Right, I believe we were in Atlantica last time, so we'll continue pressing on through Atlantica. Not that I have any idea where I was going, or can remember the controls, but we'll... Okay, that's up, that's down. Right, we'll try swimming through here. The uh, Undersea Valley... That takes us back there. Well, I don't think we've gone here yet, so we'll try going in this cave. Listening back to some of my VODs, I also realised that I seem to lose most of my energy. So, this evening, I, apart from fumbling over my words, as I generally do with these things, let's see if I can keep the energy up for this stream, eh? I get the feeling I've already been here before. Right. So, where are we going? I need to find... Keyhole. This is the general thing here, but there's no direction to finding the keyhole apart from... It's somewhere. Do I have an objective thing? Uh, no. Oh, ah, journal. Mini games, characters, and some report. Oh well. Let's see what this is. Much of my life has been dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. That knowledge has guarded this world well. Not a soul doubts that I am blessed with my people's smiles and respect. But, though I am called a sage, there are things I do not understand. I believe darkness sleeps in every heart, no matter how pure. Given the chance, the smallest drop can spread and swallow the heart. I have witnessed it many times. Darkness, darkness of the heart. How is it born? How does it come to affect us so? As a ruler of this world, I must find the answers. I must find them before this world is lost to, and to those taken by the darkness. Interesting. Uh, for a story... Oh, okay. That doesn't help. For a story? Maybe? Da -da -da. Four. Uh, the new gummy path open to another world. Nope. Right, now it doesn't have this place here, so I'm just going to swim around until I figure it out, I suppose. There must be an answer somewhere. There's a dolphin swimming around, and if memory serves from the last time I played this game, dolphin is probably the answer. Maybe. I hope. I know at some point the dolphin takes you to wherever it is you need to go to progress the story, but the question is... Where is the dolphin, and where does it take me? Because I can't remember that much. Well, I remember it requires me to go through this current. So, maybe it's wherever the end of the current is? I'll try going here. Right. That's taking me here. Where is here? What is here? Why is here? Is there a dolphin? Well, I'm not going to finish that sentence. Me thinks I'm barking up the wrong tree in this area. Oh, oh. oh, well, we're going back to the calm depths then. Right. No. No, 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 not again. Okay, what if I go back towards the palace? Does this lead me somewhere? What's in here? It's dark, it looks forbidding. Undersea cave? Oh wait, I've already been here before, haven't I? Hello, mushroom guys. I don't seem to be doing any damage to them. No. Well, I'm certainly not doing any damage to the map. Undersea grove? 
This world doesn't seem that big. It seems like I shouldn't be having such a difficult time here as I am. Ow. Yep. There we go. Ah, dolphin. Hello. What are you going to take? Um, whatever you want to, I suppose. I get the feeling he's just going to keep going around in a big circles, isn't he? Okay. Let go. Oh, thank you for that. Oh, great. I'm stuck in the middle of this. There we go. Are you in trouble? No, he didn't look like in that much trouble. There we go. I've just realised. Oh, where is it? Saw it a moment ago. There is this treasure chest dumped into the floor. It's stuck in a hole. How can it be pulled out? Um. Right, there must be a trick to this then. Now, uh, some way. Um, magic. Gravity. Nope. There. I go. Oh, oh, oh. Last. That was a stupid idea, wasn't it? Right. So I can't pull that out of the hole. So that's going to require something later, I guess. Uh, hmm. I'm getting flashbacks as black flashbacks as I'm getting, I've suddenly turned into Gollum, haven't I? I'm getting flashbacks to bloody Agrabah now. Uh, is this a cave? Yes, it is a cave. Does it lead me to an area I've been several times before, by chance? There we go. Yes, it does. Oh, come on. And this leads me to the calm depths, which leads me to this. It's all well and good, but it doesn't really help me progress the story, does it? Ah, oh, oops. Well, that's taking me back here. That's where this leads. Okay, right, we remember this bit. Marvellous. It's the same dolphin from before. Oh, uh, uh, no, no, different dolphin, new dolphin, helpful dolphin. Thank you, dolphin. What a nice dolphin. See, I knew the dolphin was the key, just couldn't figure it out. Um, what's down here? Is the loot. I fancy getting some loot. Yes, you see. Oh, open. There we go. Fix that. 
at some point I should probably start using more items than I actually am. But then again, uh, they've done such a good job with the magic system in this game that you don't really need items until... Hello? Huh? What? What's that thing? What's what thing? Oh, there's something down there, but how do I get to it? Um, if only I could reach it. Well, maybe i come back for it later? Oh, treasure chest! Right, mithril shard, nice. I'm wondering what else I can synthesize. I wonder if I can start synthesizing weapons, for example. I know I can't synthesize keyblades, but it would be nice if I could sort of synthesize some uber powerful weapons for Donald and Goofy. And cutscene time? Doesn't adjust the microphone a bit. There we go. Ooh, right. Uh, is there anything behind? Yes. Ease. Ah, and a treasure chest. You see? Always go off the beaten path, chat. Never know what you're going to find. Ooh, and the stuff inside the crates for a change. Uh, okay, there's nothing very much here. Now, you all might be wondering... There's a treasure chest right in front of me, so why am I smashing all these barrels? Well, the simple thing is, one, I remember what happens in this scene. But two, use the game design. It's just giving me a cutscene and they've plunked me right in front of a treasure chest, which is just sat there in the open. Chances are it's probably going to cause some sort of fight. Or a cutscene, or progress the story a bit. Now you know what, I'm not falling for that particular trap. I'm going to explore a bit more. Unless the game's very clever and it's concluded that I was going to do that and so it's going to lay the trap for me down here, which I doubt. Sorry, am I waffling again? Probably waffling again. I worry all things with practice. One day I'll become interesting. Maybe. Or funny. I'd, I'd quite happily be funny. Uh, you see? Point proven. Um, and I attack? No. No? Uh, bye, shark. Ooh, shiny. Hmm, the shape reminds me of something. You mean like that trident-shaped pole thing in Ariel's cave that you made a big thing about before? No, it couldn't possibly be related. Up we go. I'm going to have to fight the shark now. Yes. Here, shark. Good shark. I realised my dodge still works in the water. There we go. Is it dead? It's not disappeared. Oh, no, oh, it... Well, it's running away, that's a plus. I'm going to have to fight it again later, I guess. Right, well, we've got the tried to shape thing in me, Bob. Right, unless there's any other exits from this area. That's still a problem. That leads me into the sunken ship. Anything else in this area? Anything? No, okay then. Yep, only got a bit of a daily drop, which is a plus. It dropped frames, I should probably say. And I'm still streaming at HD quality, so I think we managed to crack this one. Uh, okay, what's spawned above me now? That was a dolphin. You know what, stuff it. Um, I need to get back to Ariel's 
cave, so... Follow the trident. And though I'm half tempted to go and fight all these enemies just for the extra XP, I really can't be bothered at the minute. <laughs> Maybe it'll bite me back later, but for the time being... Oh, oh, no, 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 Oh, piffle. Well, that's brilliant, isn't it? Huh? Oh. Oh, hello! What are you doing here? Um, I was expecting the usual modicum of enemies, not the shark. Oh, <laughs> oops, Ariel was already ahead of me on that one. Bad shark. Bad. Good shark. Right, uh, let's try this again then. There we go. Okay, so we... Ah, there we go. Oh, not... Oh, yay. Okay, too close to there for comfort. There we go. And there we go. There we go. E2 has also been... No! Oh, come on! And I'm going to get back there. And just you watch. Just you watch, chat. Bellable respawned. I have to fight him again. And then probably get swept up in the upcurrent again. And then we'll just continue this cycle for an hour. <laughs> oh, no. No, I stand corrected. Thank you, game. That's very kind of you. And this takes me here. And the shark is once again here. Hey, shark! Guess what? Fight time! Oh well, at least on the upside it's helping me gain some magic back. Ow! Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, there we go. And a high potion. Right, and then we go to Triton's Palace. Or is it Trident? Ah, oh, more enemies. What a shot. There we go. Down, 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 down. Hello. And they're dead. Wait a minute. Oh, last aerial grosso's in the other bit, isn't it? I need to stop saying there we go so much. What's a habit? I think it's partly brought on by the fact that I keep trying to think of things to say, rather than just having dead air. But I suppose in a way you've got to have a bit of dead air, especially when you've got... Well... Uh, I've got a lot of uh, You see, now I've stopped talking, I'm starting to think and I'm starting to fumble over my words again. Plenty of dead air when you've not got much to when you're not used to saying quite a lot. I can continue to retrace over what I've said about this game in the past, but I think that's going to be get quite boring. Actually, there's no problem about it. It would be quite boring. Same issue I had when I was doing reviews back in university. Oh, no, that was stupid of me. 
If you ever watch my YouTube, go to my YouTube page and go into the part, uh, go into the older parts of it. You will. I don't know why I said that in a strange way. You'll come across a few video game reviews I did, and they basically amount to me just waffling on about the same point about six times before doing some sort of sign off. Total biscuit. I was not. Oh, uh, there we go. I don't know why my game locks up like that from time to time. I suspect I probably need to try and find some drivers for me Elgato. Nice capture card, working quite well, but it's just those occasional blips where the game locks up and I don't know why. Then again, the PlayStation didn't seem to like using a, me using a capture card in the first place anyway. Amount of fat I had to go from. I mean, when I first tried to use it, I wasn't getting any sound. It's only by when I came across a post on Reddit that I found out you have to first boot the PlayStation into a safe mode and then enable a setting. Or was it disable a setting? It was one of the two. Still annoying. Oh, oh thank you, Ariel. Unfortunately, you've got no magic left, so I'm probably going to be in trouble if that happens again. There we go. Oh right, I was looking for Ariel's Grotto, wasn't I? Or Cave, or whatever it's called. What is it called? Ariel's Grotto. Yes, okay. Oh, I didn't have that completely wrong. Right, sorry, I was having a quick drink. Oh, the shiny shiny is there. Disobeyed me again. I told you not to leave the palace. 